Squarespace SEO tutorial. Rank your website with these steps. Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm giving you a tutorial on how to rank your website higher, your Squarespace website, and how to use the SEO settings that we get with our squarespace.com. So let's get into it. If you have a Squarespace website and you are struggling with the SEO, you want to improve it, then I have a good news for you. You don't even need to use a third-party tool paid platforms you can actually do the seo settings within your squarespace.com how to use these settings and even if you want to use a third-party tool how to actually do the seo so that your website ranks higher so let's actually get into it first of all you're going to go to squarespace.com and uh, create a website if you do not have any if you do not have an account on squarespace you can create one very easily using your email address or using your google account so once you create a website you can simply click on edit and it will take you to this page right here this looks very familiar right we come here most often and we you know hover around the pages option design commerce marketing and others but what you need to do is in order to get to the seo settings you will have to scroll down here in this menu and click on settings within our settings we have domains and email and then we have website you can scroll down further and you will get the commerce and then we have marketing Within our marketing, we have SEO appearance and Metapixel and ads. Now, this is the option that we are looking for. SEO appearance. Select this one. And here we have different options for the SEO of our website. SEO checklist, Google search keywords and hire an SEO expert. So this is for the checklist and we can even go to the Google search keywords to get the right keywords for our website. Here we can also check the appearance of our home page such as the pages, then we have items. These are the pages that I have. And then we have our home page, and this is what it looks like. And we can scroll down to check the SEO title format. This is where you'll be able to see and added the title appearance in browser tabs in search engine results. Then we also have the SEO site description. This is one of the important option that we most of the time ignore. The title of your website plays an important role in the SEO and we can add an SEO friendly description for the title so that the keyword actually match and we get the better results because if our website title has those key, we cannot actually, you know, create a website title with a lot of words. We need to keep it, uh, you know, to few words because it's a title, but we can add a description with a lot of keywords so that it actually ranks higher in SEO results. And this way, the better results your website will have, the more traffic it will generate. If you have a store on Squarespace, then you'll be able to get more orders. So you need to click here for enter a description and here you can add up to 300 characters. So for that, we need to do a keyword research. You can click on the Google search keywords and it will take you right here. So this is our analytics and we have our sales, traffic, geography for the keyword search. And then we have our traffic sources. Here you will connect your Google search keywords. Click on connect and you will be able to uh, simply connect your Google Analytics with your Squarespace. And this is also the way to, you know, integrate the analytics to your Squarespace. Now, this is actually really easy and you can use the Google Analytics. But let's say you want to use a third party tool. Now, these are the basic settings we can do within our Squarespace. I have another platform that I use, which is SEMrush. You can actually go to SEMrush.com and sign up for free. Uh, this platform actually has a lot of different options when it comes to a website and uh, when it comes to SEO. Um, there's already a video on the channel as well for SEMrush and you can check it out to check all of the options and how to use it. So here we can do the keyword search. Let's say I want to create that description. I'm actually fixing on this one for now. So you can see I want to create this description here and I want to do the right keyword search. For that, we can go to the keyword research option within our SEMrush. You can use any other platforms as well. So here we have our magic tool. I'm going to use this one to find the keywords and insert it in the description. So this is our keyword magic tool and the title for my website is my travel blog 
and we can even search the country from here so i'm going to go with united states for my location and here it will show me my results so you can see here we have different keywords uh, given my travel blog my greece travel blog what should i name my travel blog and stuff like that. so all of these keywords what i can do now is i can just select these keywords and insert them into my description is not shown in the title this is just like an alt text that we can add for the betterment of our website so what i'll do is i'll use all of these different tools because now i know their volume now i know the cpc now i know the results now i know the the people searching for these keywords and you can see the total volume is 4000 all keywords we have 131 here and i can even add a keyword to this list uh, similarly if you have like more uh, famous keyword and like a title now which has more keywords to it then of course it will help you improve the seo with this i can also get an idea that what is going to be the volume of my title that i have created for my website and if it's not that good i can actually change it and i can do some changes according to the organic results that i got so here we also have different options such as the traffic analytics and uh, for even after you create a website you will be able to do a lot with it and we have an seo dashboard so with semrush uh, you can go to the seo dashboard here and you can create a new project i am creating a website on squarespace what i will do is i'll get the uh, you know i'll simply get the url of my website click on create project and i will be able to simply get results for the uh, for my website and I can even add position tracking into it site audit on page SEO checker backlink audit a lot of options here we are also getting our domain analytics that will show me my organic traffic organic keywords paid keywords and others I will be getting a graph for the traffic analytics here within this uh, platform uh, organic keywords backlink analytics organic traffic insights link building is also available so you can see this is actually a pretty good platform that you should check out if you want to work on the seo of your squarespace website and with simrush we can not only use it for squarespace and we can use it for other platforms as well any website you have uh, when it comes to the link building option this one will be available in the upgraded plan and then we also have the seo content template now this one is also very useful if you have content related website where you create content you create blogs then you will be using this option then we have our advertising social media content marketing trends and more so all of the options available within our semrush that uh, will allow you to work on the seo of your squarespace website with the right keywords you will be able to rank your website higher uh, we also have the hire an seo expert option with our squarespace so you can check this one out too uh, but i think if you're going with semrush here then you will not need to hire an expert you can do everything yourself because we're getting all of the uh, you know different um, options and tools here for free uh, with our SEMrush, we also have our listing management here, site audit. A bulk analytic option is available too. And then we also have our position tracking, keyword manager, keyword gap, organic research, and more. So all of the options, again, a lot of different options to go for. You should definitely check out SEMrush.com and you can use it with your Squarespace. When it comes to Squarespace.com, it allows you to create high quality professional websites. You can create websites with backlinks. You can create websites with different alt text. You can add alt text to your images. So Squarespace itself is a very good platform and has a high reach to the audience. And you will be able to create a website that attracts organic audience and organic traffic. So yeah, guys, this brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help. And now you know how to use Squarespace SEO, the SEO option available within squarespace.com and how to use a third party tool to work on the SEO of a website to rank it higher. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, leave a comment down below, turn on bell notification and subscribe to YouTube channel.